Hi, this is Arlene from Adelante with Arlene. Thank you for asking me to share some more video blogs with you. Thanks to all the fellas out there as well as the ladies that have been writing to me on Facebook. I decided to choose a topic that's relevant to all of us. Unfortunately, is a topic of experiencing pain. We've all experienced pain, whether it is because of a heartache, of a breakup, or a loss of some type, or even the pain that we could experience about not forgiving ourselves or something we said or even did that we can't take back. So I want to share with you something that I wrote entitled Yesterday's Pain. The hurt of yesterday's pain, it tries so hard to linger on. It tries to hold us so tight that we feel like we can't even breathe. The words that once we spoke, we can't take them back. The past which tries to haunt us, to grasp us back again as it did, tries to poison the soul and leads us back to despair. One day they loved you, today they don't care. You sit and you wonder, hmm, when will it end? You sit and you wonder, who can you trust? Whose word is truth? This is a question I ask myself often, and at times I even still do. But there's one thing I know now, and that's that the past is the past. Look what's done is done. We gotta stop living in regret. If we caused ourselves the pain, if we did, just know that his word says that if we confess our sins to him, he is faithful and just to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. And if someone else has caused us the pain, we have to forgive, forget, and cancel the debt. No, I know it's not easy. But when we forgive them, it takes away their power. And now we can move on. Who can help us cut from the root those things, those people that need to be cut off from our lives? And what or who quiets those whispers of doom and despair? try to torment us. You know who and what is knowing that my Lord is there. He is the truth. He is the way. He is life. He is love. He is peace. He is forgiveness. He gives us the strength to turn over those negative thoughts to Him. Because they're going to come and they come daily. But as we draw closer to him by feeding his word, by seeking him in prayer and meditation, we go further away from yesterday's pain because you don't have to relive yesterday's pain. His word says that you're worth more. Why? Because you're the apple of his eye. So don't relive yesterday's pain. Thank you for letting me share my thoughts.